नमस्कार राधे राधे हरे कृष्णा थैंक यू सो मच फॉर योर जॉइनिंग मी एंड गिविंग मी सो मच लव एंड योर काइंडनेस विद रिस्पेक्ट इट इज रियली मीन्स अलॉट टू मी बिकॉज इन आवर लाइफ वी आर इफ वी आर गेटिंग एनी थिंग दिस इज रिवॉर्डेड दिस इज कैन से द डिवाइन ब्लेसिंग एंड वी आर सो लकी टू हैव दैम इफ वी आर सो मच एक्साइटेड टू फील दोज हम्बलनेस फ्रॉम अदर्स then there is some kinds of our so deep and kind emotions with honesty is going through that's why we are getting those emotions and also respect from others so we can be humble and grateful for everything what we have gotten in our life and what we have right now so if we see someone has and don't things that's why what we have we are so lucky to have them and we are grateful to the lord that the lord chooses to bless those from those things because with his which is so refreshable and also the beneficial not here the or all the time we think about benefit or loss because our our humble thought is there where we feel the respect the kindness or giving our only effort for wellness to the others and if we are doing those things we give our total we give our complete effort and honesty to others care and respect then nature provides us in the same way here not every time we are getting anything in our life like blessings or gift that then we can say oh we are so lucky to have them no somewhere and something like our effort with our honesty is hidden there that's why we are getting them so here our understanding in those way which is going through if from our bottom of the heart and soul then we can say we are living our life and my mother always used to say me you give your total total efforts with your honesty and don't expect anything from others because nature has the same for you and the lord the infinite lord is watching everything from you so if you are going through with this um, can say uh, means uh, from many of obstacles and hard things in your life so understand yourself you are so lucky to have them yes you are so lucky to have them because this makes you strong and also means confident to having them to facing those kinds of things in your life and you are making yourself inspiration for your front one as you know so my mother always used to say me you go through every kinds of hard of obstacles in your life then you will understand the importance of easy and comfort from for your life then you respect those comforts like blessing like gift can say and if you are not going through the hard then how can you understand the easy or comfort in your life and in my childhood i means i have remembered that my mother all the time forced me means just means test me to do those hard thing every time sometimes sometimes i thought why my mom is doing like that she is my mother she is my means she is my mother i am i am her daughter and she is doing so much so hard things with me what is this but this is the blessing for me this is the strongest weapon for me which makes me right now in front of you what i am here right so understand each of one obstacle of your life each of one hard theme of your life this is not hard this is the boon of for you this is the maker of your destiny the maker of your life and you are so lucky to have them yes you are so lucky to have them it is it is very means seems like a joke no but no it is not joke it is reality yeah it's a big reality of life if we see the hard theme of our life then we can understand the life with the bottom of our soul and emotions because everything in this universe is going to happen because of our thought yes the art thoughts reflection is there which is going through and we are seeing easily in front of us somewhere the our art thoughts are hidden there that's why i'm what we are watching them 
so understand the, the realness of our thoughts provoking because our thoughts are the real weapon and real reason for everything is going through around us because at first we create in our mind and then after some time we'll see in front of us we are the real maker of our destiny and we have the power to manifest to manifest everything what we want we can but at first we have to keep faith in our thoughts and we can do and we have to do that for the first time then we'll see how beautifully and easily we can understand and we can respect the life because life is just we never know a big blessing to all of us lord has given us and we have to make and we have to maintain our life with our thoughts and with our understanding in my childhood i usually think that what is the real means what is the beauty real beauty and i always means make myself going through the under the means phases of making ours making myself so so good looking and so beautiful but there i was not aware to understanding the real beauty of life yes looks are very important looks are very important but looks with thoughts the real provoking the dear real reason for the life source for the life's understanding this one was not means uh, the real knowledge i had in my child childhood but nowadays i can understand and i share my thoughts to my children that if you want to be beautiful if you want to be easy and comfort then at first you share share first of all from your thoughts then you will see how beautiful you are because your efforts makes you your thoughts makes you then why you are led to have them, to understanding them as you know your thoughts are the real means uh, real makeup for which makes you so beautiful and attractive for the front one in front of your dear ones so understand the real beauty of life the real beauty of life is your honest thought your honest and kind thought for everyone around what they are giving just don't don't think just ignore yes ignore sometimes sometimes we are means having the means we are going through the hard theme from the front one okay they are giving their job but we have to think only the honesty the care the respect for them then we'll see how beautifully we, the universe provides us in the same way and i used to say my my daughters you are the reason of your your life's all the shores and or your life's all the manageable things yet yeah, you are the maker of your life in short in one line we can say my daughters are, are always used to say me mom mom you are doing mean so much effort and hard working i am not doing hard work i am not doing i am only doing my job this is my worship i am doing my worship to the lord in the in front mean in the form of humans in the form of our relatives in the form of our front ones and i am doing my effort my honesty lord watches everything from me and he he just plan he just plan everything what is right for me and on the right time i'll get my and my mom, my mother used to say me if you are doing great you are doing great not for others actually you are doing great for you means so do and think great or honesty for the front one and you have the same and i also used to say to my daughters you do the same what my mom have told me so life is very beautiful understand life respect life because we are getting life by the grace of lord and we have to respect and if we respect then we can live our life yes respect is the real reason to live the life beautifully and gracefully radhe radhe hari krishna